Well, praise the Lord. Hey, I wanted to say thank you to all of you um, for your gifts, for your support, for your prayers, for everything that you have done it over the years, and especially this year for our ministry over in Ghana. GM has been able to get into places we've never gotten, uh, been able to get in to before. And so, uh, you know, with all the problems in the world, and you, you know as well as I do, the things that have uh, happened, we were kind of shut down there for a while. And we had to figure out how to get the gospel into places that um, we're not allowing us to get into. This year, um, I've been able to get in front of these guys every single day, and we have strategized, we have networked, we have empowered our guys to do some things smarter, not harder. And by doing that, we are now actually able to get into places we never dreamed we would ever get into. So, you know, it's, it just shows us that the obstacles uh, that were before us, we have proven that through the, the Lord Jesus Christ, our partner with you and our team together, we're able to jump over those hurdles and see great opportunities and great dividends. We've seen many, many come to faith. So I wanted to share that with you today and say thank you. And here is Dr. Roy Mason. He's going to share a little bit about our upcoming project. God bless, guys. Well, Mark, thank you so much for allowing me to speak to your uh, donors and your contributors and share with them the upcoming work that we have in Africa. As I'm sure they're already aware somewhat, we have a major project at least twice per year, and you, Mark, are an integral part of what we do. I want everyone to know just how vital you are to the ongoing work of GEM. You make it possible for uh, me to do the work that I do here and also there by coordinating between our, our guys on the ground in Africa and me every single day of the month. We are getting ready to go into the Ashante region of the country, which is going to prove to be a very difficult and time-consuming, tiresome, and, and challenging project. I pray that all of those who support the work that we do can come alongside of us to make that work go seamlessly as much as possible. You know, the truth is we may have boots on the ground, but those who write the checks are supplying seeds for the sower, and I thank God for every one of them. I want all of your people to know how much I appreciate you, how much I value you, how much I count on you to get the work of the gospel going forward. Thank you, Mark and to all of your contributors.